Well, one of the first things that the Quran says is to read um, and really calling upon its followers to read and understand and interpret um, the text for themselves in their own lives. And that is really the basis of the work that um, women's Muslim women's rights activists such as those as Sisters in Islam are doing is um, really understanding and interpreting uh, Islam for themselves uh, in their own way, in, in, in what works for them in their lives, in their context. Uh, and with the recognition that Again, going back to the fundamentals of Islam, that all humans are equal and there, may, there is one God, but even the Prophet is a human and is equal among all humans. Uh, and so we all have that right and that responsibility obligation to understand uh, what the religion is, is saying and what it means in our lives. Muslim women's rights activists, such as those who work at Sisters in Islam, are drawing on religion as a resource in their women's rights advocacy work, in direct response to the rise of religious extremism and, and um, politicized religion in their country. So it's a very deliberate um, drawing of uh, religion, using religion, um, uh, referencing the Quran, referencing reputable hadith in their work, and putting that into action through women's rights trainings um, with, with Muslim women on what other rights under current uh, existing Sharia or religious law within the country, as well as um, how that those laws can be reformed uh, to better support women's rights and Sisters in Islam argues to better be in line with uh, the fundamental values of Islam, of, digni of human dignity and equality and justice. At Sisters in Islam, everyone there does identify as Muslim. Of course, they're going to identify that in different ways, but that is, um, that is how they refer to themselves. And so, because this is such a huge part of their identity, even this process of going back to the text and understanding what it is, what, what it is saying for themselves and what it means in their own lives is a very personally empowering process as well.